か So this is it. This is Final Fantasy 15 Platinum Demo. So if you guys don't know what this is and you're like, what the hell, Final Fantasy 15? Like, this is not supposed to come out until like later this year. Uh, what? Did, what? what? Um, if you didn't know, last night there was a big Final Fantasy 15 Uncovered event that took place live in LA and a lot of stuff got announced, a lot more gameplay, and finally a release date for a game that we've been waiting for for some nine and a half ten years now so September 30th is the date mark it on your calendars Final Fantasy 15 will release on September 30th now this is a playable demo that's free for everyone across PS4 and, and Xbox one so you can go ahead and download it right now it's about four gigs um, it shouldn't take too long. Now, it is a short demo. It's only about 30 minutes, but it's definitely something I would suggest you go and play yourself. Um, the complete demo will be in this video. That's why it's 30 minutes long. I'm not going to be talking over the whole thing. I'm just going to do a quick little commentary over this little intro uh, so you guys can focus on the music and the gameplay in the background. But, um, yeah, no, it was a lot of fun. Um... Definitely, you see some of the mechanics of the game, like uh, the daytime changing, like when I step on this platform right here. Uh, there's points where you turn into toy cars, um, you can turn into animals and use those uh, to fight enemies. Now, when I played this demo, I definitely got a Kingdom Hearts vibe from the combat, which is awesome. Now, I did play the older Final Fantasies. I've played Final Fantasy X. Um, Final Fantasy 7 like I like that turn-based combat as well and I know some people were a little skeptical at first when they saw the new combat in FF 15 but trust me it feels amazing if you've ever played Kingdom Hearts like you know the combat in this game it's really nice um, and so I like it a lot I cannot wait for this game we are six months out so it's gonna be a little bit but we do have a lot of other games coming out in between then so it should be fine, but I'm pretty thorough in this uh, and try to explore everything. I had a little trouble because there was one part uh, about the third area in this demo about 15 or so minutes in. Um, I kept screwing up recording it, so I played this demo probably four or five times. Not that I wasn't going to play it multiple times anyways, but I did play it a lot last night. Um, but yeah, that's all I'm going to say for this. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe. And yeah, let me know if you guys are hyped for Final Fantasy 15. Finally have a release date. Um, it's going to be epic, man. Uh, if you haven't, go watch that press conference last night or even just watch the first trailer. Uh, it's pretty epic. Um, but yeah, so anyways, guys, like I said, thank you for watching and enjoy the Final Fantasy 15 Platinum Demo.
um, Noctis use Blizzara in one of those trailers and, like, see the world change around you was so dope. Like, man, I know some people were worried in the beginning because, you know, no longer turn-based combat and a bunch of things, like, kind of change it around. Plus, just how long it's been since, freaking we've been waiting for this game. But after that, last night, I have, like, no doubts that this game's going to be great. I got my new hammer. Shining hammer. <laughs> yeah. Die. Die. Dead. One hit. One shot. One kill. Won't even see it coming. Raindrops keep falling on my head. Did you turn into an animal yet? Oh, are you at the funnel area? The, the big old thing coming out of the ground? Yeah. Die. I like the if you like switch weapons while holding the attack button it will like do a fluid like combo instead of like stopping your attack and then starting up a new one it's nice it's very nice ooh look soccer balls I'm playing soccer now <laughs> okay, can it just be like September 30th already? Not that lucky. Damn. Once, like... Because, I mean, we've got... Yeah. <laughs> Once these games start coming out, like... Um... What is it? We've got... Uh, Dark Souls 3, Uncharted 4. we got a lot of games to hold us off till then, but... That'll make it easier, but until then. That game's gonna be great. Two weeks. Enemy approaches. Do, do they really? I didn't know.
<laughs> Say screw the enemies. I want the boxes. I dig it. Yes. Yes. Oh, that's so OP. <laughs> How many gems do you have? How many gems do you have right now? Dang it, you're not going to have enough. I have 372, because uh, there's this one spell you can get that literally just wipes out anything in the map. It's stupid. Stupid awesome. I want to use it one more time. <laughs> Meteor rain. Yeah, actually it might be 200, I'm not for sure. But I basically picked up every gem, I'm pretty sure. I, there, I think there's 400 total. But I'm only at 394, so I might have missed like 6, but whatever. Oh. Uh. The Citadel. Oh snap. No! Boom, bitch. No. No, 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 no. What was that? Was so dude, I just did this parry attack on him, and it was freaking ins Oh my god, I love this! It's gonna be such a great game! It's gonna be so great! It's gonna be great. Yeah, that motherfucker called PETA. Animal control.
<laughs> Not anymore. <laughs> what? Where'd you find that? Triple threat. I'm using the wrong thing. That's why I couldn't do a warp zone. I had my fire out instead of my sword the whole time. Oh no. Oh yes, overdrive. Um, basically, once you beat him as level 3, you're going to have the opportunity to fight him again as a level 15, and, uh, uh, what's his name will give you the ability to use your overdrive. I can never remember the little thing's name. <laughs> yeah, Carbuncle, you know what I meant. I beat him. Caution to the wind. One second. Carbuncle. That's your name. Wait, 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 don't do that yet. Go to the one behind that. Fight him once you get start getting him low. Carbuncle will give you an overdrive. <laughs> 